hello guys today i will show you how you can design html5 banners in google web designer i will show you complete process how you can create beautiful banner like this in google web designer i have created this design in adobe photoshop you can design your banners in any tool you like you can design banners in illustrator or any other designing software or tool so i have created this in photoshop and all the layers are separate so first of all i will extract and separate all the layers as png file and save it i will quick export as png like this i will with all all the layers now to save time i will fast forward my video and get back to you once i am done now i have separated all the images from my psd so now i will create banner in google web designer i will name this this type of banner is called large rectangle so i will name appropriate it's okay i will save and environment will be google earth and i will set the 336 by 300 so this size is not available and so i will choose custom size and 336 by 300 Okay. In animation mode I will choose advanced and press ok now I will choose all the layers and drag it to my canvas ok now I will arrange the layers this one align it to container and this will be the over pg i will lock this layers now so i will set the design as per my psd file like this one we can we can set all the layers in the design itself but the problem is that the google web designers only support the fonts from fonts.google.com and we cannot use the custom fonts here in this design i am using custom fonts like this one so i have created all the all the pngs per font itself all right Now once I am satisfied I will view this in the browser ok this looks good to me now I can start the animation here but before that I will I 
करें माई प्लेयर्स इन अ वे दैट विल आई विल एनिमेट क्रिएटर्स ओके फर्स्ट आई विल एनिमेट दिस कार देन आई विल एनिमेट द ब्रांड न्यू एंड द लाइक दिस वन like this now i will select all the layers and create keyframe and after one and after half a second i will create second keyframe for all the layers all right now i will move this slider back to my first first keyframe and now i will start animating this i will press control i will press shift key and drag it to left now i will set the properties from here i can resize this panel here and now i will set the size you can set the values here from 0 to 1 so i will set it 0.5 so it will be scaled down 50% and i can fill this all the properties here is recommended so fill will be zero okay i will set ease to ease is in out all right now i will animate the text here but i will put the cursor on the first first frame okay brand new will slide in from the left so i will shift will press the shift key and drag it down drag it to the left fill will be zero cause in the the way in the way it will also uh, like this and it like this zero tag will like this i will set the animation to zero the button will slide from the left you should make sure that this slider this play head is on the first keyframe and you change the properties okay this logo will slide from right and i will set the opacity to now i will select all these four layers and select ease okay now i will select the first key, first keyframe first one this one select all these and delete all right now i will set these like this i will now select all and move them like this one okay so preview the animation this one will show like this like this all right around 5 se second with that if i I can keyframe and I will make this bubble effect here. One point one. Then once again, insert keyframe. Set this to one. One more time. One point one. Now back to. Okay. 
this will show like this one I will select all the keyframes click in the middle insert east all right Google Web Designer allows 30 seconds total animation time so now over animations end around 5 seconds so I will now repeat this animation 3 times around 9 I will repeat this 3 times from 9 seconds alright so I will now here I will set label here I will name this repeat from here now I will add one event here once play head reaches here it will go to this speed label and it will repeat the animation okay it will lead to this level and I will set the repeat value to 2 ok once it repeat 2 times the playhead will move here now here I will stop the playhead ok now I will stop this animation here start the timer I will set like this alright it will repeat three times so here is the final design we cannot add some links or clickable area and the banner because it's not allowed to put any links or exits in the Google Ads so once we publish this one Google will add, uh, add link to whole banner to a landing page so it, it is not necessary here alright before we can publish we can check the ad validator is valid ad all the checks are good now we can publish locally and we can, we can set the border color we can choose from our PSD here I can copy this hash code and paste it in here so one, one pixel border will be added to over final banner ok now we are good to publish and we can share this zip file to our ad campaigns or we can send to our clients whichever we are designing for so guys here is the final banner here let me know in the comments if you have any problem and if you have any comments please do let me know in the comments and please share and like my video and do subscribe my channel and thank you very much for your time